indigenous people can probably reframe what the term data means. And I think part of that is the, the perceived need to have Western science, Western information uh, as a way of proving when there are problems in native communities. When you look at what kind of seeds and plants that people are working with, that every time a grandma decided which cobs of corn to keep for seed, it was based on data she had collected throughout the season, that this plant grew really well in drought conditions, in wet conditions. These ones tasted really well. These are really beautiful colors. So and that's all kind of forms of, of data collection that then inform which seeds are kept and passed on. And it's not maybe documented in the same way. They probably weren't using Excel spreadsheets and you know, other kind of, nobody's using in vivo to analyze you know, interviews with consumers to figure out you know, which corns were the best ones to keep. But there were ways that people were documenting for themselves in a, you know, in a more memory-based way. A lot of times data is collected and utilized as a way of protecting indigenous communities or proving what people already understand to be true, but then having it in a language that regulators, policymakers, scientists believe and understand and will then act upon.